Hi, yeah. Um, day 15 post op. Um, I, I had a blinding day yesterday. Made um, seems to be a load of gains. Um, just in you know, quality of movements. Um, had a long walk down to the shops with the missus. Um, quick coffee and back. Walking was massively improved. Um, and uh, I also then had um, seven hours kip, which was magic. Uh, so I felt quite refreshed, body and mind in the morning. Uh, although I'm, I'm a little bit scattered uh, now, like um, uh, the uh, double vision, and um, I haven't really had the clarity of, of head which I've had previously uh, today. Uh, something which I noticed as a trend pre-op when I was just recovering from the impact of the hemorrhage uh, was that I'd have a really good day. Uh, and then, like, have a recovery day, uh, a really good day, uh, making you know big improvements, and then uh, you know a recovery day, which would correspond to the the extent of the improvement. Um, that hadn't really presented as much post op. Well, there's been a lot of up and down post op anyway, with respect to first of all changing from IV dexamethasone to. Uh, double oral dose, then single dose, and then off the dex. Uh, so maybe, maybe that's been masking what would otherwise have been a trend. Um, uh, whether it's linked to the double vision or just the, the general um, sort of scattered, scattered head, uh, my movement seems to be a little bit off today. Um, I suppose actually that's just when walking. Um, I've been a little lazy and undisciplined in in the house. Uh, again, walking when I should be crawling. Um, I'm, I am still crawling, like, but it, you know, just little things when um, you know it's more convenient to walk, I suppose. Um, but you know, as I say, I'm still getting the crossover from the exercises. When I did the exercises today, uh, the quality of the exercises was all good. The wall stretch was mega wobbly. Um, and so whether that's related or not, I don't know. But as I say, on on the whole, I felt um, yeah, I felt, felt a little bit like my head's all over the place. Um, in some ways, it might even be the the clearer I get, I get, the more progress I get, I might be becoming more and more aware of the deficiencies. Um, but on the whole, as you can tell, <laughs> I, it, you know. Ain't a, ain't, ain't a great day, and I don't really know why. Uh, not that I'm worried. Um, I'll, um, I'll obviously keep up the just the day-to-day -day general stuff. Uh, I'm currently working on a more detailed uh, two-week post-op appraisal, uh, which I'll, I'll have a, uh, a PDF or, or similar um, that I can make available. Uh, obviously, if anyone's got any questions to ask that they'll think will be pertinent uh, or more relevant for me to give an answer to uh, whilst I'm you know, still trying to recover as opposed to way down the line when I have recovered uh, you know just just post the question and uh, I'll answer it as soon as I um, as soon as I see it uh, alrighty um, not, not much more today. So I'll continue with the day to day, and as well as that two week appraisal, uh, I want to try to um, get on a, a more specific look at each of the individual exercises I'm doing, why I'm doing it, and uh, what I would consider uh, a, a quality execution of um, of the movement. Um, but uh, don't hold your breath on that one. I'd, I'd like to try and do it all at once, but. Um, you know, it obviously took a lot of time, especially with a scattered head. Uh, but we'll uh, we'll see uh, we'll see what gives. Um, Alrighty, uh, more probably tomorrow. Ta-ta for now.